Hey, Michael Kerr here, the author of The Humor Advantage, Why Some Businesses Are Laughing All the Way to the Bank. A question I get asked very often from journalists and senior leaders in businesses is, come on, why should we take this topic seriously? Isn't it a fluffy topic, a trivial topic? I mean, surely you can't be serious about taking humor in the workplace seriously. Well, I am serious, and don't call me Shirley. Here, in fact, are three reasons to take humor in the workplace seriously. Number one, we know that culture drives success. Beyond a shadow of a doubt, it is your number one competitive advantage as long as you're intentional about building a great culture. And we know that the cultures that work most effectively are those cultures that embrace a spirit of fun, a spirit of humanity, passion, a little bit of humor and a little bit of creativity. Humor is both a driver of a great culture, but it also reflects success and reflects a positive culture. It reflects the fact that we're doing everything right. Number two, the stories speak for themselves. There really are businesses all over the planet that are laughing all the way to the bank by leveraging their humor advantage to stand out from the herd, to be heard, to help them attract top talent and keep top talent, to help them attract customers and turn customers into raving passionate fans. They're using their humor resources to lower stress and lower health costs associated with stress and illness and people taking time off. We know that humor lowers absenteeism rates at work and that it improves employee retention rates. It improves productivity. It drives innovation and creativity. Humor drives results if you take it seriously and you're intentional about using it in an effective way. And the third reason to take this topic seriously is just simply the fact that life is short and work has a huge impact on this short thing called life. Work affects our mental and physical health. It affects our families, our marriages, our kids. It affects who we socialize with, our identity, our personal growth as human beings, our sense of, of self-worth. It gives us a sense of purpose. It affects our identity, affects where you live, and it's a wee bit of a time sucker. It is the single biggest use of your energy, your talents, your passion in this short journey called life. So I don't know, I think we owe it to each other. We owe it to our employees, we owe it to our customers, we owe it to our families, we owe it to our souls to create as positive, as inspiring, as passionate, as humor-filled a workplace as possible because work matters.